of MMA UK, Chris Bungard, uh, from down to Newcastle, took on a uh, Bama doubleweight champion, over, Terrier James. Brazier. I'll take over, I dominated the dominator. Who's seen it coming? i seen it coming. And my team's seen it coming. But Lady, you've seen it coming. Continue. So are you, so are you the unofficial doubleweight champ now? I'm the new champ champ, you know I mean? I just retired. Uh, Bama for good. I mean, <laughs> that's a joke. Right. Right. <laughs> how, how, I want to get sued now. How big a moment was that for you coming down here and, and proving people just the level you are actually at? That was the that was the best experience, day, night, minute, two minutes to be exact in my life. You know what I mean, in my life, right. you can you can see it. Me jumping the cage, acting like a fanny. But that's that's came from here. That came from here. People sleeping me. Sleep on me, and me putting him to sleep. You know what I mean, I was there to rip his head off and just kick it right back to London. I don't give a fuck, man. End of the day, that sends a message out there. He was number one European, blah blah blah, blah and I said what I was going to do. I'll be honest, I thought it was going to go three hard rounds. I thought it was going to be tough, and I didn't even break sweat. And it was on Channel Five. Channel Five started with Hercules, Xena Warrior, and Fort Boyard. Now they've got Chris Bungard. <laughs> Chris, uh, a huge support down here as well. We're still getting here. I'm the even fair here. Did you hear that arena? Exactly. I'm the even fair here. So do you think the Bellator Scotland should be on the card for 2019? Yeah, bring up to the Hydro. I'll sell that fucker out. <laughs> they booed him. They went mental for me. I couldn't believe it, man. I always sell it. Two hundred tickets. It made it sound like fucking 12,000, but... I'll bring something new. I can go three hard rounds, fight the years, wars. I can fly through the air with submissions. I can choke guys unconscious, rip their jaws off, and I bring an army. And obviously I can talk as well, as you can all see. I'm the new star here. We need to start fucking fucking me out of America. Slap some of the Roy boys about, and then we'll make some big money, and I can retire on a boat with uh, bitches. Chris, <laughs> uh, how active are you yeah, looking no, to no, stay? No, no, no. I've got a girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> Chris, uh, how active are you looking to stay now after that oh, last win? After I stopped drinking for two weeks from now. Um, <laughs> got to travel up north of Scotland, go to Valencia to watch Celtic. And then I just got right back at the gym. My teammates have got fights coming up. Cage Warriors, Pauls in uh, Philadelphia. We've got to run up the Rocky Stairs, you know what I mean? They've got a statue for a guy who isn't real. What the fuck? <laughs> well, can well, can let's make a statue of William Wallace of Scotland, you know what I mean? Uh, hi, almost. Uh, Mel Gibson. <laughs> Continue. <laughs> so you'll be drinking vodka and orange tonight? Aye, the vodkas will be getting dished out, man. Oh, I've, I've, no, I've no proper 12, so I'm having to find something. I don't think the ship can sell it out here. But uh, aye, vodka. I'll raid that minibar when I get back and all. I think it's got a cold on it, but we're just ripping my open anyway, but fuck no. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Bertha, don't, don't find me. Yeah. Thanks, Chris. Thank you very much.